E-cigarette basics E-cigarettes are devices that heat a liquid into an aerosol that the user inhales. The liquid usually has nicotine and flavoring in it, and other additives. The nicotine in e-cigarettes and regular cigarettes is addictive. E-cigarettes are considered tobacco products because most of them contain nicotine, which comes from tobacco. Besides nicotine, e-cigarettes can contain harmful and potentially harmful ingredients, including, ultrafine particles that can be inhaled deep into the lungs flavorants such as diacetyl, a chemical linked to serious lung disease volatile organic compounds heavy metals, such as nickel, tin, and lead. E-cigarettes and youth don't mix adolescent years are times of important brain development. Brain development begins during the growth of the fetus in the womb and continues through childhood and to about age 25. Nicotine exposure during adolescence and young adulthood can cause addiction and harm the developing brain. Trends e-cigarettes are very popular with young people. Their use has grown dramatically in the last five years. Today, more high school students use e-cigarettes than regular cigarettes. The use of e-cigarettes is higher among high school students than adults. While the possible long-term health effects of e-cigarettes aren't yet clear, in 2019 there were reports of serious lung disease in some people using e-cigarettes or other vaping devices. Symptoms included, cough, trouble breathing, or chest pain nausea, vomiting, or diarrhea fatigue, fever, or weight loss. A study from the University of North Carolina found that the two primary ingredients found in e-cigarettes, propylene glycol and vegetable glycerin, are toxic to cells and that the more ingredients in an e-liquid, the greater the toxicity. Point two e-cigarettes produce a number of dangerous chemicals including acetaldehyde, acrolein, and formaldehyde. These aldehydes can cause lung disease, as well as cardiovascular, heart disease. Point three e-cigarettes also contain acrolein, a herbicide primarily used to kill weeds. It can cause acute lung injury and COPD and may cause asthma and lung cancer. Point four both the U.S. Surgeon General and the National Academies of Science, Engineering and Medicine have warned about the risks of inhaling secondhand e-cigarette emissions, which are created when an e-cigarette user exhales the chemical cocktail created by e-cigarettes. In 2016, the Surgeon General concluded that secondhand emissions contain nicotine, ultrafine particles, flavorings such as diacetyl, a chemical linked to serious lung disease, volatile organic compounds such as benzene, which is found in car exhaust, and heavy metals, such as nickel, tin, and lead. Please like and subscribe my best regard.